Okay, right. Um, uh, yesterday we have discussed about the general ledger configuration, and uh, I will going to ask you, uh, I mean, some important questions on the general ledger configuration. In interview point of view only. Okay, they will going to ask you like this. And if they want in depth answer, so you need to tell for the particular questions. Okay, if they want only subject wise explanation and all, so uh, you can just give the uh, definition for the question and all. Okay, <clears throat> no worries. Now I will start with the uh, Ishan. Uh, Ishan, what do you mean by posting keys and uh, where you can create the posting key? Good morning, sir. Yeah, good morning. Yeah, posting key, it is a two digit key. As per the accounting terminology, every time a transaction, it is relay on the two aspects. One is the debit and credit. If we want to know that the transaction, whether it is the debit and credit, so uh, so uh, the credit and debit, so we need to assign posting keys in SAP. So if we want to post, uh, if we want to create posting keys, we can use by OB41. So based on this, we can create. At the same time, SAP allows some of the standard uh, posting keys. Apart from that, if we want to create our own, we can create or else we can use existing posting keys. Hmm. Uh, at this, uh, one more thing is, uh, so what are the existing keys that are available in the SAP? We cannot amend or we cannot change other than we can create our own. Yes, sir. Yeah, very good. And uh, what do you mean by operating chart of accounts? Operative chart of account, it is one of the uh, account in the chart of accounts. So the operating chart of account contains the GL accounts. What are the transactions we are used in order to meet day to day operations that are all comes under the company code level? Very good. And uh, shall I uh, assign group chart of accounts? Uh, for the operating chart of account? Yes, sir. We can. Why? No, sir. No, no. So generally, uh, operating chart of accounts are designed only for the country uh, con uh, company code level. Group chart of mm. accounts are designed only for the company uh, and uh, by the mm. entire group, uh, corporate group. So it is mm. we cannot assign. You cannot assign the uh, group chart of accounts to the operating chart of accounts. Yes, sir. So we can assign operating chart accounts to the group chart accounts. No, no, no. Are you sure about the you are not assigning? I mean, uh, we cannot assign group chart of accounts to the operating chart of accounts. Yes, sir. Why? Again, I'm asking why. Uh, so generally, group chart accounts are called as the corporate chart of accounts. So generally, what are the transactions it is going on the uh, organization wise? Hmm. Yeah, uh, so we don't need to assign anything to the operating chart of accounts. Okay. So op when it comes to the operating chart of accounts, the day to day transactions. Okay. In order to meet the over, uh, uh, di uh, daily requirements, so hmm. we need to disclose information to the company level. Hmm. Okay. So that is the reason uh, we don't need to assign group uh, group chart of accounts to the uh, operated chart of accounts. Okay, no worries. Just you can share your screen right now and uh, go to the SAP login screen. Sir, uh, sir, here I have no power, sir. Okay, no, no issue. So anybody has the uh, server? Go, uh, Ashish, go to the or else uh, Ranjit or Pawan. Pawan, you can just share your screen. And uh, please log in into the SAP. Have you done with the, uh, uh, I mean, uh, the general ledger configurations found? 
Yeah. yeah. Okay, no worries. Yeah, uh, you can just go to the transaction code, I think. Uh, OB13. OB13. Uh, okay, go to the position and open the operating chart of records that we have created. Hmm. Double click on the operating chart of records. B here. I have asked the question on the group chat for the consolidation purpose. Shall I, uh, I mean, assign group chat for the particular, uh, what is the uh, operating chat of account? I assign this group chat of account to the operating chat of account. I have asked, so Ishan has said the answer uh, to the particular question, that the answer is no. We cannot assign group chat of accounts in uh, for the operating chat of account. So if you say like this, an in interviewer they will go. Uh, I mean, they will come to know that. So this is the knowledge this consultant has. Okay. See here, we have to have group chat of accounts for every chat of accounts, operating chat of accounts, and specific chat of accounts. See why we we have to assign the group chat of accounts to the particular operating chat of accounts. Group chat of accounts. I mean, uh, this contains GL accounts, right? And this is used by the uh, entire corporate group. And what is the entire corporate group? Suppose we have taken the KLM shopping. So KLM shopping mall is the entire one, uh, corporate group. Okay. And they have, uh, uh, I mean, they have operating chart of accounts. And they are following the operating chart of accounts uh, based on the company code. So here, whatever the group chart of accounts that you are following, okay, and then next here it is used by the entire corporate. What is the corporate group here? That is operating chart of accounts. Okay, that is KLM shopping mall, and this enables group reporting. Group reporting means what here in the description? Uh, you can see that operating chart of accounts. Okay. So in the operating chart of accounts, with the help of group chart of accounts, we can able to see the group reporting for the operating chart of accounts based on the company code. Okay, if you say like this, automatically they will come to know that. So they, he is a real time consultant. If you don't know the initial point of the particular things, so how you can are uh, going to cover or uh, how you can manage your experience in your job. So that is the main thing. So that is why I'm asking the interview point of view questions and all. Okay. They will not going to ask you like this. They will going to ask you some definitions and all based on that. I mean, uh, after moving to the, uh, I mean, each and every topic, they will go in depth. Okay. No need to worry. Okay. But you need to have uh, some more uh, important uh, knowledge on the particular topics. Okay, Ishan. All right. So, yes. yeah, no worries. And uh, one more question for you. What do you mean by country specific chart of accounts? Country specified chart of accounts contains the GL accounts, and we need to uh, meet the country specified requir legal requirements. Okay. Shall I assign this group chart of accounts to the country specific chart of accounts? Country specified. Uh, yes, sir. So here, if we want to maintain uh, outside of the mm. India, so we need to maintain this country specified chart of accounts. If you are not, uh, if you are not running any outside of the uh, India uh, company code, so we don't need to uh, maintain this one. Very good. See, 
country specific chart of accounts you know very well and you have given the answer and you have given the answer that so i have asked you about the uh, group chart of accounts shall i assign this group chart of accounts to the country specific chart of accounts and your answer is yes and you are saying a little bit uh, uh, i mean uh, 100% answer to the particular questions so how you have come to know the we can assign group chart of accounts to the operating chart of account so you know very well based on the country specific wise so we we are going to assign this group chart of accounts okay based on that only okay based on gl wise only we will going to get the proper report okay so how you can get the proper report is very very important i mean uh, uh, coming sessions only you will come to know the why how we can download the uh, gl reporting how we can download the vendor reporting and how we can download the uh, customer re uh, reporting you will come to know that one okay so initial points is very very important initial stage is very very important so otherwise how you can come to know that so this is the exact point that is uh, Okay, all right, all of you. So, is it uh, no? Okay, is it okay for you, uh, uh, Ishan? Yes, sir. Okay, so, uh, okay, no issue. And the next question is for Pawan. So, Pawan, what do you mean by account group and where uh, you can create the account group? I mean, in which transaction code you are going to create the account group on those? Account group is uh, like it's where related to the financial things we are going to be working on, related to the company, where the each and every transaction which we are doing in the company, and the hmm. account group the OB that me OB that me was uh, transaction code. OB 13. Hmm. Is it correct? Is it correct? Uh -huh. Okay. So to create the account group. OBD, we will use the transaction code. Yeah, OBD. And one more question. Okay. So, uh, shall I assign the chart of accounts to the particular account group? And why we need to assign the uh, chart of accounts to the account? Uh, we need to assign the chart of accounts for a particular group because of uh, where very much we have a lot of the transaction while going to do operation. For each every transaction, there will be activities like a recording of a transaction with the length and uh, and we have uh, some options related to the check the configurations related to them so we need have to be specific uh, uh, thing to be added for them to note it down to uh, in order in order to know the uh, functions related to the transactions I think. yeah very good uh... Okay, right. So very uh, good answer. Uh, the next step. <clears throat> so, if I want to, uh, okay, that is the question. There is no any questions for the account group. Um, okay, no worries. The next one is here. Who is the next one? 
I think uh, Ranjit, you have not attended. Ajit, have you prepared the subject and have you prepared the configurations on all? Ajit, are you there? Hello, Vanessa. Yeah. Sir, I'm unable to log in my SAP, sir. You're unable to log in your SAP? Yes. Why? So oh, I'm using the what they given the credentials I'm using, but I'm unable to log in. Yesterday I'm trying, no, no. but I am unable. What is that? Me also. Sorry. You know, I name code I mean, I go download over to you. And I'll link open Jagan and I go the icon of Sunday. I'm not a jipper or outlet. I will let the jipper do this on the so I'll turn out later. Okay, don't take the dog and the forward chest. No, yes, automatic game. Well, like a support, you know, send this to phone just as he automatically support this phone. Okay, okay, thank you. I'll easily just within 10 minutes. You will solve all this. Okay. Okay, right. Uh, uh, all of you. And uh, then next one, who is the next one? Shekhar, are you there? Yes, sir. And what do you mean by uh, retain on a uh, uh, retain earnings? And what is the yes, exact use of the retain earnings? Yeah, retain earnings is nothing but on of the GL account, and it is a balance sheet item. And that the financial year system carry forward the balances one fiscal year to another fiscal year. Okay. The transaction we are using to OB53. Okay, very good. And uh, <clears throat> um, if I assign not the reserves and surplus account, okay, I mean, if I assign the surplus account to the particular retained earnings, so shall I carry forward the balance to the next fiscal year? Yes, we can carry forward. We can carry forward. Yes. Okay, very good. Profit and loss account to balance sheet account. Yes, very good. Automatically, for the auditing purpose only, they will come to know that. So this is the exact loss that we have got. And uh, whatever the con I mean, whatever the P and L statements that we have and balance uh, balance sheet uh, statements that we have. All those will be included in the auditing purposes. Okay. Yes. Sir. Sure. And uh, these are the interview questions about the particular uh, uh, general ledger configurations and all. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Now, uh, we will going to start one new session. Okay. So now I am going to stop the recording here. Um, so once it is stopped, you can just go to the chat box and you can just download it the video and save it in your folder. OK, so don't uh, I mean, please download the video. Otherwise, so I mean, if we cross 30 days of the training sessions and all automatically uh, videos will not be available. OK, in your our chat box only. OK, you cannot download it. Why? Because uh, for this kind after the 30 days and all OK, after completion of the 30 days and all you will not going to see any video. I mean, you will going to see the video. You cannot download it. OK, we are not the premier person. OK, so that is why um, I'm not taking any premium membership on all. Why? Because we have only 10 members students only. OK. All right, all of you. <clears throat> 